Hello there everyone, how you doing today? I hope you're all well. Today we're playing Spiritfall, and you're getting a video today instead of like a stream until like the evening if I stream at all, because I am not feeling too great and I'm just hedging my bets if I don't feel better in time to get you guys a stream. So we're getting ourselves a video. Like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Now we're playing Spiritfall. I'm taking the Mask of Ash Faroom. Now that's an endgame item that I'm not going to spoil how you obtain right now, but for some reason there is absolutely no guide on how to do that, so I might do that in a later video. Like, there is no guide whatsoever on the internet how to get this mask. I searched all of YouTube and it wasn't there. I had to go to Reddit to get this information on how to get this mask. So it's very interesting actually. Now we're gonna get our, try to get ourselves a fire build. We got ourselves Mr. Bird Boy to start with. And we are taking Shattering Launcher. Now then, uh, we're taking Fog of War, Resilient Shields, Dangerous Elites, Cursed Relics, Perennial Tactics, and Dark Interception. We also have ourselves the beads that give us better rarity of boons, because I just like that relic. It's one of my favorite relics, you know what I'm saying? And to get that at the beginning of a run just feels good. Now let's start this run, eh? But up, 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 uh, I'm losing it. Okay, let's go. I am going to fist the little blight gerbils. They have been fisted and thrown into the earth for their sins. Now we're going to take Scorching Launcher, because we need some way of applying burn. Now we are going to get the Luminous Gem to upgrade our launcher. And they fall to pieces. Love to see it. We'll take some per dormant embers. I keep calling them perennial ashes. But no, that's not what they are. Next, we're getting another burn boy. Uh... <coughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Another burn boy boon. Stay still, Mr. Grasshopper. Nobody loves you. There we go. Hopefully we get a burn attack. No, we get Scorching Bolt. But I'd rather take Combustion, because Combustion's just a better upgrade. Now we're taking the Dust Deposit next, because I do not want to fight a boss right now. I do not have the power level necessary to take him on. There we go, that's another room done. Give me my dust. Dust is a form of money in this game, in case it wasn't obvious. For those who are new to the game. I love the, I love the, uh... What's it called? The fist, the gauntlets. Because, uh, they absolutely shred shields if you have the right ability on it. And it absolutely feels wonderful. Also, I've taken almost 50 damage so far. That's not good. Now, let's see. We're going to do a reroll here. Mm, I'll take Scorching Bolt, I guess. I'm not happy about it, but what can you do? I'm taking more maximum life because I need more maximum life in these runs. Because it just feels good to have more maximum life. Prepare for the fistening! Prepare for the fistening, you absolute foolish fools! There we go! I'll take a combat room because fuck it, why not? That's another 25 health for me. Lovely. I hate th I hate that Mothman. No, Grasshopper. He's a Grasshopper. He's not a Mothman. Mothman's a different enemy. Uh, 
There we go. Destroy the scorpion, man. No, but... How dare you, Mr. Grasshopper, man? How'd you betray me like that? You're absolutely rude. You rude, rude little grasshopper. Well, not so little grasshopper. He's actually freaking massive. We're getting two holy dice, and let's see what we can sell here. I'm going to sell the Scorching Bolt, because I don't want Scorching Bolt, if I'm being completely honest. Now we're going to the Hidden Rift next to get both abilities. Hello there, I've come for your loot. I've... Sir, give me your loot. Give me your... Hey, hey, hey. Give me your loot. Give me your loot. Give me... Stay still. Hey, stop that move that makes you move to the side a bit. It makes me not hit you in the face. Get dunked on, sir. That's two. Ah, dang it. Oh, that's one way to dunk him down. Now well, let's get these abilities. Hopefully we get the... Nope, that's a dousing attack. I don't want dousing attack. So we'll take Jaws. Uh, I guess we're not doing a burning build. We're taking freezing attack. As much as it pains me to say I need more power in my strikes and... Oh, I hate this. If if I got if I got burning strike here, I would have screamed. Uh, let's see, scorching bolt and ice shards. Ice shards is a good stake for a frost attack build. Now let's fight this lady. We're going to wreck her face and her other parts. None of that, lady. None of that. I hate that sort of that sort of ability of yours. There we go. We broke her shield again, and now we're gonna fist her. Hey, stop dashing! Stop dashing! Stop dashing! There we go! Right in the schnoz! If you don't know what a schnoz is, Chad, ask your mother. She totally won't slap you for asking. Now, something else Mask of Ashfaram does is give you a boost on these, uh... Boons you get in between stages. Like, it's not Agility 1 anymore, it's Agility 2. So you, that's more attack speed. Or Judgment 2, you get more damage to bosses, and so on. The special abilities like Power Slide don't get affected by this, though. So we'll take attack speed and more damage to bosses. We will take Power Slide 2. And we'll save that last essence for the next area. Now then, we're going to Miss Frosty Butt Lady. There we go, that's that room. Give me my Frosty Boy. Let's see, Magic Shards is just wonderful to have, so we'll take that. We're going to take the Vitality Crest for more attack. Now my shards that enemies spawn when I smack them in the face spawn and destroy other enemies. I, they got me. Hey, I, I got you. Hey, no stabbing me. Hey, stop stabbing me. There we go. Got more max health, but I took some hella damage in that room. That's not good. Ooh! Hidden Rift. Don't mind if I do. Good 
Go to space, sir. That's one. There we go, that's another one. To the moon you go! There we go, well, let's get our wonderful, yummy, delicious boons. Oh cool, Scorching Dash is nice to have, actually. I'd like some Scorching Dash. We'll take Twister, because I like that move a lot. And we got another essence out of it. That was a very productive room. Now we're going to the Relic Tinkerer, because I want some relics, folks. We're going to reroll that. More attack damage and more bolt damage, and while grounded, launchers deal... Yeah, that's just good to have. And that's good too, but uh, we'll take the Geomancer's Ring. The Geomancer's Ring is just too good to pass up on there. God, doing video games when you're, like, very tired is actually way harder than it seems. Oh my god. It's way harder than it seems. Don't do that at home. We'll get rid of Jaws. Actually, I have rerolls. That was not worth it. I just wasted all my rerolls and trying to get the attack to be sold. <laughs> now we're taking the relic chest. There we go. Absolutely wrecked those folks with a twister in the face. Let's see what's in here. Ether stone, but your status effects have less duration. Yeah, sure. I don't care about that. We're gonna take on Mr. Bear Boy, because I want another relic. Oh, I almost got hit by his giant laser beam. Ooh, that's not good. There we go, he's dead. Lovely, lovely. We love killing things in this house. We are murder hobos. Now, let's see what we got here. More damage to the enemies. I mean, sure, we'll get rid of Etherstone for that. That way we uh, don't have as much to worry about in terms of cursed relics. Let's see, we're buying this. Your Scorching Bolt deals increased shield damage. If your bolt slays an enemy, it breaks its shields, refresh it. Ooh, nice. That's good, actually. Uh, we'll take Lost at Sea, because that gives us more damage on bosses. And we're obviously taking our yummy, yummy, delicious healing. I love some healing juices. There we go, that's one enemy dead. Get out of there, splash zone. That's another dead enemy. Now we're just gonna let, oh, get out of his face, get out of his face. This is gonna suck.
We're just gonna clap him into oblivion. There we go, he's dead. My gosh dang button keeps jamming so I can't attack as regularly as I want to. Oh boy, now let's take that heal. What do you got for me, Miss Muscle Mommy? Each attack, well, no. Your launcher deals damage, perfect launcher, more damage to the enemies. We're taking more damage to the enemies. We're using Maelstrom and... Yeah, we'll take Sky Fist. Why not? We have more than enough essence to buy it. Now we're going to the tribute room. Now let's buy ourselves a Nash Ferrum upgrade. Let's see, after you visit a room with no combat, gain max health. No. Actually, it's good for bosses, now that I think about it. Uh. We're taking intermission. Now we're gonna use a stray soul here. Freezing attack got upgraded. That's basically the best thing we could have gotten. And we're getting this to get a relic. That's not worth having. But I mean, uh, we can get rid of vocal prayer beads. There's no upgrades on that. Now let's go to the next area. Oh, hidden rift. Don't mind if I do. Oh, come on, you brought you re shield your shields. That's one. To space you go, sir. To space you go, like I said. Now let's see what we got here. Give me a roar. Oh, Shatter. Frost-inflicted enemies receive massive shield damage from... That's not worth taking. I'll take Frostbite. And we're taking Shoreline Drift for some passive dust gain. We love ourselves some money. Some treasure, as it were. You know what? Going to settings. Going to controls. Oh, shit. Shit. Uh, oh, we control the settings. There it is. We're going to turn attack into launcher and launcher into attack. There we go. Things are going to go much better now. Now we're going to beat up your folks. See, as long as the buttons don't stick, I should be fine. Burn away, sucker. Now uh, we're taking a luminous gem next, I think. There we go, they're all destroy the shielded enemy. There we go, you've been dunked on. Let's go. Let's get ourselves our ember. I keep calling them ashes. Let's see. We're going to upgrade Lost at Sea for more damage on bosses. We're taking Mishved, because that's basically our way we're going now.
There we go. Destroy that enemy with extreme prejudice. Those cloning elite enemies are annoying, though. I will say that. It's like, seriously, seriously annoying. Now we're going to take Shatter, because that's just not going to get out of my face. Attack deals plus damage, plus cooldown speed, plus bolt damage. Love to see it. Spin the wind, suckers! There we go. Now let's see, taking another combat rune. We're going to take Equilibrium. More damage while poison means more tornado damage. And now we're getting a hollow grant for some healing. Very good, actually. We needed that healing very badly, believe it or not. Now we're going to take more maximum health and go on to the boss battle. Let's go! We're fighting the Warlock next. Oh, he's already summoned Mr. Skelebro. You already have to summon your Skelebro? That means you're weak! There we go, he's dead. We love dead things here, like I said many times before. We have 13 essence, oh my god. That's a lot of essence, just so we're clear. When you're launch- no, we don't want launcher. Attacks your launchers, yes. We'll take more- oh, agility 4. You have some- I have so much attack speed right now. This would have been so good if it was like a, uh... Lightning Bunny build? Oh, that would have been great. Now yeah, we're we're gonna go this way because that gives us some max health. We got so much attack speed it's not even funny. There we go. Now what you got from me, Mr. Gollum? Two holy dice. Oh, we get both of the items. I could have gone either way and got the luminous gem. Oh god. I am very much angry at this revelation. That's one. That's two. There we go. Give me my stuff. Give me my loot. I live off of loot. Now we have to fight the Statue of Harmony. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Stop running away from the statue. I gotta beat your statue up. I regret everything right now. There we go. I'm taking way too much damage here. There we go. The boss is defeated and I hate that sucker so much. Oh my god. 
That took way too much damage there. We're attacking Glaciating Frost for more Frost stuff. Now then, we're going to the Celestial Exchange next to buy some healing. Because that's necessary after all that damage I took. What's Antipode? Non-boss enemies with three stacks of frost are instantly slain if they combust. Well, that's not gonna happen, but... I mean, I'm not upset about it. More shield damage, very nice. And so let's see what Mr. Waterboy gives me. Hydration. Would have been really nice to have that earlier, but I ain't gonna complain. Okay. I love dunking on enemies with that. Come on, freeze with your freeze with your bro. Not freeze, fuse. Fuse is the word. Fusion, ha! Huh? Stuff like that. Now, uh, none of that's worth getting rid of. We're going to take Uncharted Waters. And the vacuum guy outside is really ticking me off right now. Oh my god. Sorry about the vacuum, uh, the, the guy doing work outside. I apparently can't control when he does that. And he has to do it right outside my window. Of course he does. And it gets louder whenever I complain about it. Okay, what do we got here? What do we got here? I'll take bonfire. And what do we got here? I'll take DR's mystery mix. Removed a lot of my shield damage. I'm kind of upset about that. There we go. Now what do we got here? Mr. Combat Rune, okay. I'll take Incandescence because we keep our multiplier up pretty high anyway. Now let's see. Mishfed, what you got for me? I'll take cold presents. And that. Oh, they gotta do it right outside my window, don't they? Now he's doing his ultimate attack. None of that, you ain't smacking me in the face today, sir. Oh, as he smacks me in the face with a pretty significant attack, actually. Oh, come on, I dodged that. There we go, he's dead.
But I took some really significant damage there because I got too comfortable. So that's on me. That's on me. Give me a heal. There we go. Almost that full. Now we're at the brink. Three rooms until the shop. There we go, that's a room done. Now on to the next one. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba, I'm losing it. Ah, sm stop smack! So I really can't do anything against you while you're doing that, okay. Be that way. There we go, it's dead. On to the next room. Think this is the last room? No, no, no. Oh, how rude. Go to space! Come on, that down attack's really hard to avoid when I'm trying to smack you. They pretty much get free hits on me when they use their down air attack. Now we're gonna get a heal before the final boss at least, so that's okay. Oh, finally, Mr. Crip Boy decided to show up in the last chamber! Uh, Whatever. We're gonna reroll a bit, try to get... A no, we got Sharp Claws though, that's fine, I guess. Oh, we got Flash Decay, just in time. Thank God. I was hoping Flash Decay would eventually show up. Whew! Flash Decay is a very good ability. That's why it's legendary. They're taking 200... Oh, shit, I almost fell. There we go. No oh. Oh, you almost had me there, lady. There we go, that's phase one done. And we're actually doing really good. Surprisingly for how this run turned out. Please don't tell me I just jinxed it.
on, get down here, lady. Get tornadoed! There we go, that's another dunk to the dunk realm. That's another dunk to the dunk realm. There we go, just one more bit of health and then she's dead. Wonderful! That's the run for you folks. Thank you all for watching. I will see you all next time. Hasta la pasta. Bye-bye.